Folks, it's, uh, it really is a pleasure to be here with you today, back in uh, BC country. I'm uh, familiar with the territory of the Okanagan Valley, having survived two summer cadet camps at Vernon. It's good to see that uh, things, are, things look different in the Okanagan when you're 13 versus when you're, well, my age, and I won't tell you what it is. But it is good to be back here amongst you. Um, for, the, uh, for clarity, I am currently the deputy commander for police in the NATO training mission in Afghanistan. And uh, what that means is I am the senior military leader amongst the leaders within the NATO training mission responsible uniquely for the development of and the uh, indoctrination of and then the eventually the sustainability of Afghan's Ministry of Interior, its national systems that connect the ministry to its forces and its police forces for the nation of Afghanistan. Now, if someone had told me that when I was showing up at a recruiting center way back when, in 78, that, hey, somewhere down the road, you're going to be a deputy commander for police in a place called Afghanistan, I would just accuse them of smoking what they, what they make there. But it, it is an incredibly satisfying uh, position and mission to have in light of the 10 years of the Afghanistan mission that many of us have experienced one way or the other or another, be it through international crime, be it through actually participating in the mission or knowing people that have, and have at the very least having seen it in the news. Um, it's an incredible mission that I'll tell you right up front, it needs to be done. I'll also tell you that it can be done. I'm gonna show you today that it's being done. And ultimately, I'd like to be able to conclude with you that if we persist, it'll get done. And uh, many of you are represented by police officers or police professionals in the mission today and or have had personal experiences of doing it yourself or have or know people that have. And I can assure you that what's going on today is an incredibly different mission than the one you would have seen two years ago or five years ago. And that's my aim today is to try to tell you a little bit of the story about what's different today from the mission in Afghanistan as it relates in particular to helping Afghans create their national police service and giving them the means to create a service that can actually endure for Afghans so that we can eventually roll up our carpet and bring it home and allow them to carry on serving and protecting the people of Afghanistan themselves. Uh, before I get into uh, my prepared uh, text here, I'd like to um, thank you um, it's a it's nice for a person who serves to be served 